Hello and welcome to a new video on Bamboo Homestead. So this week I'm going to show you how I make my Rosella jam. The Rosella sadly had too much rain again um, and they rotted a little bit inside so the petals didn't really fall off. I'm sorry. So most of them look like this so the petals should have fallen off and it should have bulged up a bit more to two to three centimeters it says online and you got a little one. This is not quite matured yet, but it will still do better than the moldy one. Anyway, we're going to see what we can do with it and um, how much we're going to have at the end. doesn't really matter because you just add half fruit and half sugar and yeah, it doesn't really matter how much. Oh. So like, that's pretty big. So here it's like really nice, a big little thing there. Mom, Don't so many deep far with your hand. Yeah, we got already colored hand, colorful hands. Yeah, this wasn't ready yet. This wants to open a flower still, but doesn't matter. We still eat it. But yeah, this is what we got, and the rest I really can't do much with it because they're still very, very small. And I just hope we get another. Um, okay, Otherwise, they look at this stage. So this one is not ready yet, this has obviously got the beautiful flower on it still. But then this one is obviously pretty mouldy and gross. <laughs> and it's really sticky and disgusting. That's the flower petals. I need a few. Blah, it's disgusting. It's like really <laughs> Then another job we have to do is um getting all those snow peas back on the trellis so some have fallen down like that some are falling down like this and then I just help them a little bit to hold on to sometimes hold on to with the tentacles like that and then they can climb up where they're meant to and over here as well they look pretty good sometimes I help them to go up to the next trellis and roll it around Cool. Here it doesn't have tentacles yet. <laughs> Can't do much with it. Here's a few under the net because that's near the broccolis. So I'm gonna just pull them out. And I actually need to give them a different trellis because we want to take the um, fly screen off at some point. And so they're just making a tangled mess on the floor. So I'm gonna help them. Stand up a bit more. Oh look that kind of baby. Look. It's always good to take them off right in the beginning so they just go in emergency mode and make more. Da. Yeah. Actually, clearing this 
is clearing the fence, hacking stuff down. Wait for it, Max is pulling it out again and he has apparently another idea. <laughs> Here there is Kaya is making a hole and we put the seeds in quite deep because the first year we've done a mistake and didn't do it them that deep. Um, probably maybe like three centimeters or something quite deep more deeper than the actual seed size um, because the rats would just dig them out and chew them in half and stuff so like this they yeah they don't really find them as well Does he want to eat when we're out here now? Mandarin. Mandarin. Can have a lucky one. <laughs> so Max has just pulled out this whole trellis, this uh, cucumber trellis out of the garden bed. Just pulled it out and now we're going to harvest the cucumbers, take all the vines off and then we plant snow peas around it because we don't have so many good trellises like this and the trellises are made here they're probably not gonna last that long because they're not very strong because it's just string um but we'll see how it goes <laughs> Ist schon Fisch gefangen? Nein. Noch nicht, gell? Muss man noch ein bisschen warten.